Right now, the search is on for a missing weapon stolen from the inside of an FBI SUV. Yeah, and this morning, the fears that that firearm being in the wrong hands has law enforcement concerned. So let's bring in Brianna Smith, who joins us live with the status of that search. Good morning, Brianna. Good morning, Heather and David. The search continues for that stolen handgun. It's a Glock 19 M9 millimeter, and now the FBI and Pittsburgh police are working together to try to find it. Now, the FBI says someone stole an FBI vehicle in Shenley Park around 1.30 yesterday afternoon. Then about three hours later, the vehicle was located in the Hill District on Hollis Street and Wiley Avenue. But now the FBI is focusing on finding the weapon that was inside the SUV, and they're devoting significant resources to capture it. Now, we spoke to a retired FBI agent, Larry Lycar, who says it's very rare for FBI weapons to be out in the public and it poses some serious problems. You don't like the idea of your weapon uh, being available now to someone who obviously is a criminal. And it's something that that weapon would be used in a crime, that, you know, that it even makes it worse. Lycar says agents usually carry their weapons or make sure they're secure. So he says if the agent didn't properly protect the gun, the agent could face punishment by the Bureau. Again, it's a Glock 19 M9 millimeter, and now the FBI is asking for your help in trying to find it. They say if you have any information, you're asked to contact FBI Pittsburgh. Reporting in the Hill District, Brianna Smith, KDKA News.